This is the first time I'm doing this. I'm discussing my latest rap song. It's called Kratos. It's about people turning their back on me. A lot of people did that. <laughs> Gotta always watch your back. You know. So, um, I'm here to discuss the lyrics, breaking them down for you. This is actually my first time doing it. So the hook is, y'all be traitors and tired of all your haters. Because I'm a teen who will rise to school two hours later. Y'all be traitors. Now, the hook is... You know, it's, it's, I mean, two minutes I performed the song I wrote and then the rest of the song I freestyled. Um, the hook is not that good, I will say, but when you get to the lyrics, then you'll understand it. So, the first the lyrics are, no call, no show, Eddie Healy left your bow, your burrow. <laughs> no call, no show, Eddie Healy left your bro. Now that is what happened. He he never told me he was leaving. He he just up and left. Like so um so um bringing more down. No goodbye or nothing. Eat an English muffin. But it's something when Jordan Floyd did the same thing to me too. Boy, I'm losing my fucking mind. I can't believe it's 2018 now. Holy cow. So, Jordan Floyd did the same thing. My, I'm going to show you a pic of who left me because they both left. And it kind of pisses me off that they left and they didn't tell me because I I needed them most. Like, right now, I need them most. So, I knew they would help me out, but um, I'm at the show. A pick of them right now. Um, so you got your boy Jordan Hullet. So show this. Whoa, Hullet. Whoa, uh, Here we go. So the guy in the blue sweater, the tall man, that's Edward Healy. The guy in the black man. And then on the side, way in the side, Jordan Floyd. So those are the two people who left me. Um, I wanted to when I when I was writing this song, I was like thinking to myself, I want to diss them, but like I don't know how. Like so, um, let me get to the hook again. Y'all be traitors and tired all your haters. I'm a teen, rise at school two hours later. Y'all be traitors. Now this is the interesting part. This this verse right here it says when y'all. When all my friends left, Willie Smith, that's another staff member at SES, Jordan Floyd, Eddie Healy, they broke my vest. No tat on my chest. Yeah, no tattoos on my chest. <laughs> when I tried to be friends with them on Facebook, they declined my friend request. That is true. They When I tried to be friends with them, Facebook, they declined it. Like, I wanted to stay connected with them, like, but they... Wouldn't let me stay connected with them, and that kind of pissed me off. Like, um, I think this is the first time I'm like breaking really down a song, like talking about it, because this is an interesting song. I think it's my second single of the album, and it's really interesting. Never give them out 24 7 album. Um, the hell is up on my chest, skull in the middle, no sleep on my pillow. So, I got that score, that's what I'm talking about, skull in the middle. Um, no sleep in my pillow, that is really important verse. It's talking about my mom, because I haven't been getting a lot of sleep, you know, I've been having nightmares and I've been stressed out and stuff like that. So that's what that verse meant, no sleep on my pillow. Chest in the middle, no sleep in my pillow. So, um, let's go in the middle and just do it. And then we get to the hook again, you all be traitors, I'm tired of all your haters. Because I'm a teen who arrived at school two hours later. I'm show, I'm about to show a picture of Mr. Uh, Healy. Uh, I mean, not Mr. Healy. I'm Mr. Smith. I love it. The future is interesting, you know. What? Eddie Healy and Jordan Floyd. You me kicked off my team. I needed you most. And you left. You were two asshole rednecks. Now, I'm not disrespecting them on anything. I mean... If they want to leave me, then that's fine, because I've had people leave me before, but, like, um, let me get to the hook again. Um, I'm not 
a guy who likes to leave people, like, I'm gonna be there for him, like, I'm gonna still try to contact him on Facebook and, um, try to contact him on Instagram, but, um, if it don't work, then, you know, it's, it's fucked up then, um, and then when I get into the freestyle part, like, five, like the four minute freestyle part, then that's when, because um, I'm like, I told him Mr. Healy about my phobia, same thing, I told him Mr. Healy about my phobia, I told him Mr. Floyd about my phobia, and guess what, they both turn their back on me, you want to, you want to turn your back on family, can't do that, um, you know, Monday, Mr. Carly was supposed to help, he turned his back on me, a lot of people be turning their back on me, and uh, I think that's what the song Cradles is mostly about. It's about people leaving you and you can't do nothing about both. You can't, like, um, look at my lyrics again. Um, you can't do nothing about it. Mr. Floyd's in, what, Philadelphia? Hey, Philly. Donnie Creed! No. I have no clue where the fuck Mr. Healy at, though. Try to find him. <laughs> um, but try to get the phone number. That's what the call, no call part was about. No call. Um, I asked Mr. Scooter if I could have his phone number. He's like, I'm not allowed to give staff 